What's up, YouTube? This welcome back to Nerdly Reviews. Today, in Nerdly Reviews, I am reviewing something that I've wanted to review for a long time. I just haven't gotten around to it. This, as you all know, is the Death Star. But the lid won't stand. Crap. Alright. This is the Death Star. Um, it destroys planets. But this is a Star Wars science project. If you don't know what that is, it's like a thing for kids. Uh, where, um, it's Star Wars based, like this stuff right here, but, um, it's the science. Um, I had to build this myself, not the whole entire thing, just little small parts of it, but still, it was, it was a pain in the, pain in the, pain in the butt. And, um, so it, I'm gonna pick this up, because I don't want to reveal what it is. It's on this little stand right here that has the M Imperial symbol on it, so it looks kind of badass. So, well, you already see. So I'm just gonna show you what this is. So I'm just gonna pick this up. So now this is around. This is black. Now if I pick this up more, more questions. So basically, I had to put the light bulb in and stuff like that. So what this is is a Death Star planetarium. So basically, when I turn off the lights or whatever, and I uh, press this button right here, and I had to put the batteries in too. That was a pain. It projects this 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 it projects the Star Wars uh, universe um, all around the room and then when I take this little part here it projects the s stars of uh, Earth's solar system all around the room so I'm going to turn this off and uh, very quickly I'm going to turn off the lights uh, it will be dark for a little bit. Um, the light from the TV will be on though, because I have Captain America on. And then um, we'll be able to see. Alright, so it's really dark now. All you can hear is my voice. I don't even think you can see my face. I'm going to find the button on here, and then we're going to start. Damn. So let me pause this for a sec. Sorry, I couldn't find the button. Here's the button. So, um, again, you can't see me, and they're not really project. Uh, let me, uh, turn off the TV, maybe that'll help. Oh, here we go. Now they're projecting on the, uh, on the light. But I don't think you can see that, because my camera's kind of crap. So I'm going to reveal this. Ha! And, uh, really? It doesn't pick up on here, either? Aw, oh, that just sucks. But, basically, if you, I think you can kind of see it on my face and stuff like that. And then my arm right here. That's um, the Star Wars galaxy right there on my arm. So um, if I turn this, um, oh wow, Hoth is on the outer room too. So right around here, if I do this right, this is Hoth right here. Sorry, sorry, that was just um, bam. So mid rim. So I shift this. Outer room. So right like here is where Hoth is. And then um outer room. Sorry, I'm I'm just uh finding plans. Um so then because you guys can't see, so I'm projecting it on myself. So then um if I go like this maybe. Oh uh, right oh crap. Right near the bottom of my hand is um tat Ry Ryloth. And then right above it is Tatooine. And then I'm just trying to find um, Yavin 4. Oh, there's Kessel right here. Um, my thing is on my chin. Um, oh, here's Yavin right here. So um, right up here is where Yavin is, and that's the rebel base. So yeah, this is pretty sick, I have to see have to say, um, I wonder where Coruscant is, I never really took a look on this kind of thing, I found Endor Ray, so that's pretty sick, um, oh, here's Coruscant, Coruscant's right at the top right here, and then, um, I wonder where Mustafar would be, dun dun dun, I found Hoth, so I should be able to find, and then, um, oh yeah, this is sick, Right out here where there's no space, I think right around here is where Luke Skywalker was hiding in, uh, episode 7 there. Yeah, unknown regions. Yeah, not for long. Okay, I'm just looking for, um, I'm going to blind myself. I'm going to look for Mustafar. Come on. 
So just, uh, sorry, just give me a sec here. And, um, well, here's Mon, Mon Calamari down here. Um, fun fact, um, 12 parsecs is actually a distance between, um, things. It's not, like, seconds or whatever. So, um, the Kessel Run is when you go near black holes and stuff like that in, uh, the Star Wars universe. And, damn, I can't find it. Maybe it's not on here. Crap. No, that wouldn't make any sense. Um, so, um, it's near, like, black holes and stuff like that. And, um, yeah. So, sorry, I keep, I keep apologizing. I just keep seeing crap that looks like Mustafar, but it's not. Uh, maybe this was made before the movie came out. I don't know. I don't feel like taking this thing apart to find Mustafar. So let's just go, yeah, 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 Mustafar's there. Hooray! No, wait. Ah, oh, okay, I got it now. So, if I use my Star Wars knowledge correctly, Mustafar was close to Coruscant, which would be in the inner room, which would be here, or if I show it on my face, there, are so it'd be there, and then, it was close to Endor too, don't ask me how I know that, I'm just thinking, because everything, if you think about it though, so Yavin's like right here, the rest of this crap right here, when they were doing like, um, everything, wasn't really, um, shown a lot, Except for Mon Calamari, because that's the ocean world. And they don't... What the... Nah. That's a W. Shit. Sorry. I planned this out before, and I found it before, but I can't find it now. I know this was made before the uh, seventh film, so um, they don't have Jakku on here, which kind of sucks. But, um, I can't find Mustafar, which sucks. I keep thinking that I see it when I don't. And that sucks, because Mustafar is, like, a big deal. Shit, found it! Yeah! Okay, I found it. Mustafar is uh, right where my thumb is right now. See that? That's where Mustafar is. Damn it, I spent, like, Four minutes looking for that crap. Okay, so Mustafar is in the outer rim, and it's near Tatooine. Ah, damn, Darth Vader could have just gone there, man. Mm. So that means that when the Emperor took Anakin back to Coruscant, it took them like hyperspeed only takes you through three rims at a time. So hyperspeed only takes you distance of one. So that'd be here, to So it would take them like three days. Just think about that. Anakin Skywalker, burnt from Mustafar, in his anger. Three days. And then he uh, becomes Darth Vader. And then Padme dies. And then Luke Skywalker happens. And then, uh, and Princess Leia. Yeah. R.I.P. Carrie Fisher. And then all that fun stuff. And then Rogue One. Rogue One was awesome. So, yeah. So that's it for this video. I know it's spooky because if I go like this, my face disappears completely. Ooh. So, anyways, that's it for this video. Um, I got this off of Think Geek. Uh, well, I got it for Christmas. If you guys want to get it, I don't think it was that much. Um, all you have to do really to put this together is the light bulb in the, in the middle, and it came with extras. I threw them away because I didn't feel like it. And then um securely put this part on and this and uh, put the batteries in and there you go so that's it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it please like um if you want to see more stuff like this and subscribe uh, because i don't know i don't know why people say subscribe because it doesn't really do anything um and um if you're already subscribed click the little bell um in the corner where it says uh sub subscribe so then you can get updates when I upload more videos like this. Okay, and that's it. So um, I'll see you guys later. Bye.